Hello everyone! Now, today I'll be showing you how to turn a sentence from active voice into passive voice. Okay, so imagine that you have a sentence in the active like, I help my mom. Now, first of all, we need to see, uh, we need to identify the parts of the sentence. So, help is the verb, okay? This verb is in simple present tense, verb, okay? The I word is the subject, who does the action, okay, that's the subject. Now, my mom is the object of the sentence, okay, now who receives the action, let's say. Now, in order to turn this active sentence into passive, what I do is I follow some specific steps. So, the first thing that I have to do in order to turn it from active into passive is to front the object and to make it subject. Oops. I need to form to front the object and make it subject. Now the second thing is um, use the verb be in the tense of the actual verb of the sentence. So the, the be verb will take the tense of the sentence. Okay. The third thing that I have to do is actually turn the verb into, oops, I'll find it immediately, come on, okay, I'm not into it, okay, that's it. So I'll turn the verb into past participle, okay, and then what's next, in case I want to mention who did the action, I will have to use the agent, okay, the agent is my and the person. So let's see that uh, from theory to practice. So we say I help my mom. The first thing that we said we have to do is front the object. So my mom will get at the front of the sentence since in English syntax is very strict and the subjects are always uh, fronted are at the front, okay. The second thing is to put the verb to be in the tense of the verb. So in this case, we have the verb help, which is simple present. Okay, mind you. Now, the verb being the simple present is is, am, is, are. Okay, so in this case, my mom is. Next, what I have to do is take the verb of the sentence, that is help, and make it past participle. So help, since it's a regular verb, and then say by whom by me. We need an object pronoun now. This was the subject pronoun, so it turns into an object pronoun, me, you, him, her, it, us, you, them. Okay, now imagine that the sentence appeared in a different tense. So, for example, could say, at the moment I am helping my mom. Now, let's follow the steps once more. So the, th the first thing that we said we do is front the object and make it some subject, my mom. And then what I need to do is use the verb be in the tense of the verb. The verb here is present continuous. So I need present continuous of the verb be. So it's, it's being. So my mom is being. Next thing I have to do, use the past participle of the ver verb helped. And then the agent by me. That's all. Now, imagine that we had the same sentence in the simple past. I helped my mom. My mom, now, the simple past of the verb uh, be is was. My mom was the past participle of the verb helped by me. The very same sentence Okay, in the, pre in the past continuous could be something like this. Yesterday, I was helping my mom all day long. Now, what I do is front the subject once more and then put the verb be in the, pres in the past continuous form. Okay, my mom was being helped by me. Okay, and that's the past continuous in the passive. Okay, 
I'll take this here. Now imagine that we have the present perfect tense. I have helped her here. Okay, I'll make it a little bit different. Now what I have to do is front the object. Now the object pronoun hair will become subject. So it's she is, no, she has, it's present perfect of the verb be, she has been. The past participle of the verb help, helped by me. Okay, if I had past perfect, I had helped my mom, I had helped her, it would become she had been helped by me. Okay, I will help her, that's future. She will be helped by me. Okay, now mind you that this agent, this by, in the passive is not that important because what we care mostly about is what what happened to the person, okay, and not who caused it, okay. So it could be eliminated. She will be helped, okay. So if I have a sentence like the thieves, thieves, come on, okay, now it's good. The thieves were caught. by the police, I could skip this part where it says by the police because of course we know that the police catches the thieves, okay? So we mostly care about the fact that they were caught, something happened to them, okay? And not who did it, okay? Now, mind you that in the passive voice, instead of having the verb be here, you could have the verb get, but this is more colloquial, I would say. They use it in the oral when they talk. Okay, so I could say, she got helped, they got caught, he got killed, okay, something happened to them. So that's all with the passive voice, guys. It was a, a, a quick video in order to revise a little bit. I hope it has helped you. So I'll see you next time. Bye-bye, take care.